Good morning, folks. We're starting with a report out of the Associated French Press. I'm asking for a spot of help this morning locating a source or a fact given in that article and which is now being recited across the net. The claim is that Earth's magnetic shield is 15% weaker than in the mid-19th century. If you're new here, that may sound startling, and rightfully so. Veterans of the channel know our shield is fading, but when we last heard, the number was only 10% came from NASA back in 2003 and was widely confirmed. Now I'm assuming the AFP got their info from the ESA sources, given that this is a swarm article coming out of France, but I can't find the actual citation or source for the now 15%. For those mathematically challenged, that's 10% loss in over 150 years, followed by another 5 in only 10 years. The magnetosphere is Earth's protective shield from energy in space. Anyway. These are seasonal changes on Mars, and they're saying it's salt water. Quickly recall Star Water Chapter 1, water in our solar system. Despite everything we knew existing as liquid underneath the ice sheets on Jovian and Saturnian moons, we knew it was only a matter of time before the liquid was found on Mars. I'm betting Mercury's next as we found ice at its poles. Perimeter boundary of icy regions are likely to have water, yes? This is not the same level of storm they saw here last week. Instead, we're seeing consecutive convergence lines coming up and on top of the land there. First convergence at Germany already. As far northeast as you can go here is the genesis of the snowstorms that linger back across the northern states and meets the next lines cresting the west coast now. Trying to keep Earth at the relative bottom of the moving diagram so you can see Mercury coming in to conjoin the sun. Apollo enters the Lasco C3 frame and kicks off 10 days of crazy planetary alignments. Back to right now, solar wind speed and density are slightly dropping off this morning as instability does the same, readies to enter our deeper systems. Remember that last CME is expected today, pretty much any time. Insert any of my solar quiet comments from the last two years here, just don't sleep on the spots. The central development all doing their own thing at the moment northern region of the bunch is purely negative and won't flare unless the lead complexes. Middle group is the smallest in a calm beta class, meanwhile the lead down south is beta gamma delta with magnetics clearly mixed, complexed, and umbral magnetics mixing within one penumbra. The coronal fields are closing off soon and the openings are not terribly large anyway, but add their minor worth to the space weather, what's coming in the law of averages, and we're middle of the road on the watch with the West Chile rise in my scope. Shots of an asinine amount of plasma leaving an active region just behind the eastern limb. Other SDO and close-ups from Iris to close. Eyes open. No fear, it's 5.55 a.m. Eastern Time and that's the news. Be safe, everyone.